Now, before I assemble the pillow, I want to do the embroidery part of getting this applique onto the center panel. When you get an applique die from AccuQuilt, they also offer some free embroidery files. It will stitch down all of your pieces with either a blanket stitch, a satin stitch, or a motif stitch. Today, I'll be using the blanket stitch. So I have the file all loaded onto the machine, and first it's going to stitch an outline of where the first piece needs to be placed. <laughs> So without unhooping it, we need to fuse this piece right where that outline is. So I've got my wool mat, get that placed just right, and then diffuse it down. The best thing to use is one of these little shovel irons. If you don't have one of these, you can use your mini iron. Just be really careful not to touch the hoop. And now that that's fused in place, we can go on to the next stitch. Next is going to be the blanket stitch around the outside of the tractor. And now without unhooping it, we will move on to the next stitch, which is going to outline the fenders. And now we can fuse that in place. There we go. And then I need to turn this to a six and a half inch square and I want to do it on point. So I have a six and a half inch square ruler. Get it right where I want it. And that's ready to add into my pillow. So next I'll show you how to do the June Taylor quilt as you go pillow cover. 